In today's video, I'm going to be going over five ways that you can make a YouTube intro for free. Whether you're a beginner or an expert, want to make a 2D intro or 3D intro, these five intro makers will allow you to make your own customizable intro for absolutely free. And each of these five options have their own pros and cons, but I made sure that none of them will have any sort of watermarks and they'll allow you to export your intro in HD. Now, if you guys like what you see, be sure to hit that like button down below. And with that being said, let's get started. Now I'll be linking all five of these free intro makers down below in the description, but the first one on the list is Canva. And you might be thinking Canva is a photo editor. How can you make an intro from it? Well, Canva actually has a lot of elements that you can add to your canvas, including background videos, GIFs, as well as text, stickers, shapes, and much, much more. Basically everything you need to create an intro. And Canva has even made tutorials on how you can use their website to make an intro for free. Now what's great about Canva is that it is very, very easy to use and it's also very easy to customize different elements of your intro. And on top of that, Canva is purely browser based, which means that you don't need to download anything in order to use Canva. You just have to go on their website, follow their tutorial, and then you can create and customize your very own YouTube intro. Now, because Canva is primarily a photo editor, you can only make 2D intros, but within the types of 2D intros you can make, you have a lot of different options. Now, if you're somebody who's into video editing and you wanna step it up a notch, I would recommend DaVinci Resolve. DaVinci Resolve is a great video editor, but you can also use it to make YouTube intros. And especially in the latest version of DaVinci Resolve, which is 17, they've actually added a bunch of animated text options, which makes it super, super easy to create an intro in a few minutes. Now DaVinci Resolve does require a download and you do need a powerful computer to run it. But if you can get DaVinci Resolve to run on your computer, you can use Fusion and the animated text features to create a great custom intro. Now DaVinci Resolve does have a learning curve, but I've made a tutorial on it. And there's also a bunch of tutorials by a ton of great YouTubers, which I'll link down below, such as Casey. And they actually teach you how you can create your own YouTube intro step-by-step -step in DaVinci Resolve. Now, like Canva, you are restricted to mostly making 2D intros within DaVinci Resolve. But the great thing is that you can customize these intros as much as you like, and you can export them all the way up to resolutions as high as 4K. Now, before we move on to the next intro maker, I just wanted to give a shout out to Offio, which is the sponsor of today's video. Offio is a great video editor and graphic design tool that you can also use to make intros and much, much more. What's really cool about Offio is that it's an online software where you can create videos and minutes. Whether you want to make product videos, social media posts, or make YouTube intros, Offio allows you to quickly make these videos by having a very easy to use drag and drop interface, as well as tons of different templates which you can use to create your own videos in minutes. Now, Offio is great if you're somebody who's going to be making a ton of different animated videos and wants a graphic design tool that's really easy to use and requires no download. Now, Offio costs $20 a month, but they're having a limited time deal where you can get a lifetime subscription for $98. So if you guys are interested, I'll link it down below. Anyways, back to the video. Now, the third intro maker on the list is Crello, and Crello is probably the easiest intro maker to use on this list, but it's also the most limited in terms of features. This is because with the free version, you're only limited to five downloads per month. So you have to make sure that once you make your intro, you're certain that you wanna use it because you can only revise it five times. Now with Crello, you can access a ton of their intro templates. So what makes it really easy to use is once you find a template you like, you can simply just customize it, add your own text and then download it. And Crello is fully browser based, so you don't have to download anything to actually use it. Now, if you're looking to make 3D intros, I would highly recommend Blender. And I've been recommending Blender for the last five years. Basically, Blender is a free modeling tool where you can create 3D models, but what you can also do is create 3D models of text and then animate them to make your own YouTube intro. And people have been doing this for years. Now, Blender is fairly hard to use, and I wouldn't recommend learning it just for the sake of being able to make an intro. But what you can do instead is you can go on YouTube and look for free Blender intro templates. And there's a ton of people that have made Blender intro templates, which you can just download and customize so you can have your very own 3D intro. 
What's great about Blender is that there's so many templates available and you can easily customize the font and colors to create your own 3D intro. Now the final intro maker on the list is Panzoid and Panzoid is a great intro maker for both 2D and 3D intros. I've actually made a full tutorial on Panzoid, which I'll link down below, but essentially, Panzoid is a free intro maker, which you can access through your browser so you don't have to download anything. And within Panzoid, you can find a ton of different intro templates, both in 2D and 3D. And then once you find a template you like, you can easily customize the text, colors, particles, and much, much more. Now, what I really like about Panzoid is that you know, you don't have to go anywhere else to find the templates. All the templates that people make are available directly on the website and you can have a custom intro made in less than 10 minutes. So if you're looking for a very easy way to make a 3D intro and don't wanna download anything, I would highly recommend Panzoid. But that's about it. Hopefully you guys did find an intro maker that you're going to be using to create your own YouTube intro. And if you did, be sure to give this video a big thumbs up. And as always, thanks for watching. My name is Iovo and I'm signing out.